Hey, what's good, people? What is good? Going strong here. 57 subscribers. I gained one. We were at 58, but then I lost one. So, like, it is what it is. I guess such is life. But 57 subscribers strong here. I have no script for this one. I'm just gonna talk real quick before my battery dies, because my battery's gonna die soon, probably, on that camera, so... Um, I was watching the NBA playoffs, and I was just like, okay, let me make a video here. So, what I'm going to talk about in this one is just the lack of, the lack of rules. And I think it's just better to understand the landscape in terms of society as we see it now. So there's no, there's no real rules, no set, like, set of things or rules that you have to really follow. Um, what I'm realizing about society as I get older is people are just making up the rules. Whatever group wants their own set of rules, they just basically lobby governments and count city councils and things like that to create a certain set of rules that work for that interest group without regard to the rest of the set of rules that were prior or even the set of people in general that the rules are going to affect. They just want their own rules that work for them and protect them with no, no real acknowledgement of other groups or the other people that are going to have to live by those rules. So, you know, with that being said, I see no point if you want to take, if you want to pretend that there is still society, which, you know, a lot, a lot of MGTOW people lament the lack of society. So we have some kind of desire for a general society so in my opinion i would say just try to understand the landscape there you know there there is no i wouldn't i wouldn't go with those whatever those rules made by all these separate factions it's hard to take that seriously because even when you read some of these policies and some of these rules that are that kind of set the framework for whatever you know for to be honest whatever part of society you're in so if you're in a profession they have a set of rules if you're in a certain county they have a set of rules all the states have their different rules and that's not a bad thing necessarily, but to me, it's something that I wouldn't really pay attention to as much. I would, instead of listening to that stuff at this point, I would just try to understand it. So just understand the landscape, understand how those things came to be, and then basically do your own thing like i mean hence the name migtow right hence hence migtow i mean we already you guys already know this to be honest just in terms of the fact that you're you're listening to a migtow channel right now you already know this and you've already probably subconsciously made this up in your mind but i would say yeah just understand the landscape which we're all trying to do and have your own rules and live by those. And don't impose your rules on others. That's why people say MGTOW's not a movement, which I kind of agree with that, to be honest. At first I was like, what do you mean it's not a movement? But now I'm understanding what that means. It's a philosophy, not a movement. It's just a recognition of the landscape <clears throat> and a recognition that, okay, here here's the landscape. All these people don't really know quite what they're doing so let's kind of step back from that understand it and then live by our own set of things 
that we want to have for our own lives because there's no, that general life, there's no general society of stuff really to go to. I feel like MGTOWs, a lot of them, we, we wish that there was, but there simply isn't. And at this point, we've, we've already tried, at least me, myself, I've tried to find communities where I'm like, okay, I can fit in here. Um, you know, I can, I can you fit in with this society and then go into the general community with the backing of this society or whatever, like the backing of this group. But then I kind of realized, hey, you know, I mean, that's what everybody's basically, everybody's doing almost. It's like they have their, their own group and then they're trying to force that, those, those values, those, those rules, not even values, because some of these groups are valueless, honestly, but just they're trying to force that group to be like the top group. And to me, I, I don't, I don't really subscribe to that. I don't even like there being a top group or anything. Like to me, that's, that's stupid. It just doesn't make sense in the context of history and humans. Like it, that's just, um, you know, that that's just unnecessary competition in, in my opinion. And competition isn't bad, but when it's just, when it's a crabs in a bucket kind of doggy dog competition, where someone has, where people have to lose. Like, there's, a, like, people have to lose in terms of it being life in general and nature. Not everyone can win. People are gonna die. Everybody dies. Everybody eventually loses in that sense. Everyone dies. People get injured and things like that. So it's not perfect, but that's when you're going against nature. As a society we're supposed to build up what i thought was we're supposed to build up humans and society in order to like in order to contend with nature in a sense like i i wasn't expecting nature to just like t to basically encroach on what was what we thought was society because then that means there's no society if it's just nature all around and then there's no, there's no, nothing built up to counteract that. That means there's no society then, um, for lack of a better phrase, there's no, there's no buffer zone. There's no buffer zone. And to me that that's pointless then. So it's pointless to, cause now we're just, there's all this infighting and then there's no point being in that. Cause you might as well just be in general nature then. In my opinion, there's no point in pretending you're in a society where all, there's all this infighting. You might as well just be in general nature. And then you can choose to build up a different society or I feel like that's what MGTOWs are doing. We're trying to build up something different because you realized the old whatever it got corrupted. It got flooded, basically. It's like it got flooded and it's you know, now there's just like, there, there's water in it. It's, you know, it's like a lot of it is below water. Some of it's still above water. And like people are trying to climb to the places that are above water, but there's not enough space. So the people who are in those places above water are like beating down the other people who are trying to, you know, get above water to safety. And MGTOW dudes are basically we're like, okay, so there's water here, we're swimming, and we're basically, we're, we just keep swimming, and we're trying to find other land at this point. We're trying to find other land. We dipped, and we're just swimming basically right now. That, that's what it seems like to me. And we're gonna get somewhere, in my opinion. We're all kind of going in different directions, but I feel like there is some land mass that we will get to at some point. And there's, some of these MGTOW content creators, they've kind of said, okay, here, maybe they've, they've gotten to a landmass or they've built up enough, they've gotten enough of the scraps from what was their previous society. And then they've put it around themselves to the point where now they have a good enough boat going 
so like they're moving in style if you will but um okay enough with that metaphor but that that's basically why i feel like what i feel like we're at at least like at least to me um it's just the recognition that okay there's no real society so now it's basically up to us to define our own rules and to define what we want to get out of this whole thing life or whatever you want to call it and then we have to move toward that and then just understand the landscape of what other people are doing understand it but don't necessarily um i mean at least me personally i can't necessarily subscribe to any of that and i tried to i've tried to for years honestly but none of it none of it really was something sustainable for me i was like okay it's not sustainable for me so so there it is i'm trying to this is a boat i'm trying to create i guess with this channel so yeah that was kind of what i was thinking and i have a lot of different content coming up and i'm gonna intermix different ways of giving you that giving you that content whether it's scripted non-scripted long form short form whether i intermix different images in the video or just have it me talking i try to put timestamps from all from from now on because i kind of like the timestamps thing but yeah honestly i like just honestly i really like just getting your guys' comments and um responding to them and yeah that that's that's like one of the biggest kind of reasons that's like one of the biggest things i basically like about this channel to be honest and that 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 is where that is one of the reasons i started it to be 100 percent honest with you like because i was like okay um like i was like whoa this is there's no society here so that that's why i, I started it because i was like who else kind of realized that there's no society here was it only me um yeah and i'm glad it wasn't only me here i'm glad like not all this weird stuff going on that i'm, I'm just glad there's there's other people who are trying to like sit back and analyze this stuff but yeah anything else i don't know i'm pretty sure that's all i want to say there um yeah pretty much all i want to say there Yeah, I'll try to bring you some healthcare network videos soon enough. Um, yeah, that's basically all I gotta say. The thing about unscripted is like you don't really know when you're done or not. That's a, that's why I kind of like scripted better, but it takes days to really put together a whole wholesome video. Yeah, but I'm glad like getting daily viewership now, so I'll tr you know I'll I'll try to intermix. I want to keep putting out content, but I, I want to like do up the content pretty well too. So there's like a battle to be fought with that because it takes days to make like a high quality video. But it's a better, it's like a better product, but it's quicker to just, you know, say kind of have these videos where I just talk and then put it out. And I do like talking unscripted because then I can get more thoughts out. When it's scripted, it's too red. It's a little bit too regimented, but then I have to improve on it. So I'm improving, you know, with each video as we go along. So every week there's some improvements. I like that. So yeah, just stick with me, and that's basically it. Done talking now. Peace out. Hopefully, we'll see who wins. Suns versus um, the Nuggets. We'll see who wins today. All right, peace.